Hey guys, Allie with Tip B. Today we're going to look at an app called Panel 360 uh, for the iPhone. Um, I've used several apps before, um, Pano being one of them, uh, Auto Stitch being another. Um, before I do that, I'm going to jump in. I took one earlier that I could actually take time with. I didn't want to make you guys sit through me taking a Pano um, that was a really ridiculous uh, in length so I went ahead and stitched one together earlier and I'll show this to you guys it stitches pretty nice um, as you can see it did a pretty good job of capturing things as I moved around um, as you can see it, it stitched pretty much everything right where it should be and now we'll jump into the app and I'll show you how this works so we're gonna open Pano 360 I had a couple things pulled up here but we're gonna go there and go to restart and you're going to see um, that you're going to have like a grid here. It uses the gyroscope. So I'm just going to stand here and I'm going to rotate in the middle of my living room and show you how this is supposed to work. So basically what you're going to do is you're going to hit start capture. And you can go ahead. And you probably want to keep that little arrow inside that green part. But as you can see, I mean, it takes a bit, but it's pretty good at stitching a pano together. And since it uses the gyroscope, you don't really have to move too much. You can kind of just rotate, which is kind of nice. And I'm not going to do a full 360 view here just because that would take quite a while. I'm just going to do a little bit further. And as you can see right there on the TV, I kind of, I went a little quick and I got a little bit of a bump there. But, for the most part, it does a pretty good job. So, we'll stop right there and click Done. And I will show you, as you see right here, this is the panel I just took. And I'm just kind of spinning around, and it's showing me that panel right there. So, you can see that you have a choice to upload it to Facebook, email it, save it to your camera roll. So, if you just click Save, it renders it and then it'll save it in your camera roll. So we'll let that save really quick. This is nice, I mean, I would do it, I was uh, planning on doing this outdoors, but it's dark and I was not home in time and outdoors, there probably wouldn't be too big of a point. Um, if you upload this, you can share them as a 360 view, as a side note, so if you upload this to Twitter or whatever you wanna upload it with. So I have it in airplane mode right now, so. But um, as you can see here, you also have settings you can go into. You can have the regular 360 view or you can have the stereographic view, which kind of looks like a, reminds me kind of a fishbowl type thing. Um, if you do a complete 360, it'll completely rotate around a center point, which is kind of a cool effect. I probably wouldn't use it too much. You can toggle the, black, the background between black and white. So um, I prefer the black background, so I have it on that. Um, that's the main gist of this app. Um, they just released a big update to this. Um, if you guys are looking for a cool panel app, definitely check this one out and let us know what you think. Thanks, guys.